Well, January is a great time for cleaning up tools, sharpening spades and secateurs, sending off things like strimmers and lawnmowers for servicing, and if you're running short on things, getting hold of new tools ready for the coming year. Another thing you can do at this time of year to get ready for the exciting season ahead is clean up all your pots and trays and labels. Once you've planned what you're going to plant this year, time to make sure that you've got enough seed and of course that it's all in date. Well, sweet peas like to be sown really early and always to make sure you use really long tall pots like these or some sort of root trainers like this. than getting out in the garden, doing some early weeding, any bits of mulching that still need doing, making it look really ship -shape. But I think today, we might just give it a miss. Well, on these cold, miserable days, we might rather stay inside, but we mustn't forget the feathered friends that we've probably been feeding through the winter. Lots of different things that you can use to feed birds, but we really like these fun, bright ones here at Eden. Well, autumn raspberries simply need to be cut off at the ground, ready to send up new shoots next year. Before the sap starts to rise on our grapes, we need to get them pruned, so we're going to be doing it this month. If you've made a New Year's resolution to eat more healthily, there's no reason to wait for the spring. You can start now by sowing a whole range of sprouting seeds, such as alpha alpha or mung beans. I've had these soaking overnight. I just need to spread them out in a thin layer and I'll put them somewhere warm and dark and literally within a few days I'm going to have tasty sprouts to eat. In the winter we get a huge amount of enjoyment from the house plants that we have. Of course it's worth remembering that when we light log fires and have central heating churning away that plants are going to dry out more quickly and it's important that we remember to water them more regularly. Of course here at Eden we've got a lot of house plants to look after.